Okay, so magsasagot tayo ng isang problem. And sasagutan natin itong problem 15-14. Magyan natin dito. Problem 15-14. <clears throat> Ang requirement ng 15-14 ay prepare journal entries to record the transactions. So, journal entries ng transactions January 1 hanggang December 15. <clears throat> And next, prepare a summary of the permanent investments of Negros Company showing in detail the number of shares and the total cost for each investment. Dumara tayo sa letter A. Journal entries. <clears throat> the securities owned by Negros Company were held as permanent investments. During the current year, the following transactions occurred. So, journal entry, January 1, purchase 10,000 shares of King Corporation at 70 pesos per share. So, to record the journal, to record yung journal entry for the January 1 transaction, debit investment in equity securities, credit cash at what amount? 10,000 shares times 70 pesos per share. That is 700,000 pesos. So, investment in equity securities, talaga natin siya ng Dash King. Yung name ng corporation na binilhan ng shares. Okay, tapos na January 1. March 1. <clears throat> Purchase 10,000 shares of plastic company for <clears throat> 660. Debit investment in equity securities pangalan ng company ay plastic company credit cash that is 660,000 pesos Tama. 10,000 shares so pag nilagyan natin yan ng formula dito at 66 per share Sino, kinumpit natin yung, yung cost per share ng plastic company. Next, April 1 Receive cash dividend of 5 pesos per share from King Corporation. Okay, ito yung King Corporation. Ito yung transaction natin sa kanya. Meron tayong 10,000 shares. So, 5 pesos times 10,000 shares dahil yun yung hawak ni company na shares of King Corporation or King tama, King Corporation. Debit cash 5 pesos times the 10,000 shares of King. San galing yung 10,000 shares? Ito. Ito yun. That is 50,000 pesos. Credit dividend income, 50,000 pesos. Next, July 1. Receive 20% stock dividend from the plastic company. Okay. So, ang dividend, pwede siyang in the form of cash, pwede, siyang, pwede rin siyang in the form of non-cash asset or non-cash um, asset like property, uh, plan and equipment na dividend. Or pwede rin siyang stock dividend. And kapag stock dividend, hindi ito nire-record as dividend income. Ano ang nare-receive dito? Ang nare-receive dito ay additional shares of stock. So, si Plastic, nagbigay siya ng 20% stock dividend. So, sa transaction July 1, mag-record pa rin tayo ng entry, pero hindi journal entry. Memo entry sa July 1. Memo entry or memorandum entry. Ano yung description? Lalagay lang natin dyan yung receive 20% stock dividend from plastic company. So, ang plastic company is meron tayong 10,000 shares sa kanya. So, 20% noon ng 10,000 shares is 2,000 shares. So, nakareceive tayo ng additional 2,000 shares of stock from plastic company dahil sa stock dividend na 20%. Receive 2,000 shares of stock or 2,000 shares representing 20% stock dividend. in ilang shares yon 
10,000 shares held of plastic company shares now held is 12,000 shares okay so ngayon ang hawak nating shares from plastic company is 10,000 plus the 20% stock dividend which is 2,000 12,000 na yung ating shares of stock from plastic <coughs> company next August 1 purchase 10,000 shares of Makati Corporation at 50 okay debit investment in equity securities Makati credit cash that is 10,000 times 50 pesos 10,000 times 50 pesos equals 50,000 pesos October 1 ano naman <clears throat> the shares of plastic company was split on a 5 for 1 basis ang share split is ito yung change in number of shares without affecting the retained earnings and the legal capital so paano yon ano yung ibig sabihin nun? so itong sabi may share split down na 5 4 1 plastic company ibig sabihin magkakaroon ng changes in number of shares na hawak natin kay plastic company ibig sabihin sa kada isang share natin kay plastic company papalitan siya ng limang share ulit sa kada isang share natin kay plastic company papapalitan siya ng 5 share so kung meron tayong 12,000 shares kay plastic company 12,000 kasi 10,000 na March 1 plus the 2,000 shares received dahil sa stock dividend, meron tayong 12,000 at nagkaroon ng share split sa kada isang share natin kay plastic papalitan niya ng 5 so kung meron tayong 12,000 shares kay plastic pagkatapos ng 5 for 1 share split, magiging 60,000 na yung shares natin kay plastic company and ang share split is changes lang siya in number of shares without affecting retained earnings or legal capital, meaning hindi mababago yung cost of um, investment natin kay plastic, meaning shares lang nabago pero the cost would be remain the same so ang entry to record the share split is memo entry lang din, nalagay natin yung memo entry for October 1 uh, receive 60,000 shares or 60,000 new shares sorry, new shares pala to 60,000 new shares as a result of a uh, 5 4 1 share split share split of 10 or sorry, 12,000 shares of plastic corporation. So, that would be our entry for October 1. Memo entry lang din. So, meron na tayong dalawang memo entry. July 1, tsaka October 1. Madami na ang ating journal entries. And remember, ang requirement natin sa letter B is required a summary, nagre-required siya ng summary of permanent investment. So, kailangan nating i-monitor yung ating um, investment and equity security. So, bago tayo mag-proceed, hindi muna natin dito yung, ang mga, yung mga information about, yung information so far about sa ating um, journal entries. Okay, una, 
we have to dito na lang sa upper upper right ng ating yellow paper we have the investment then the number of shares and um, cost of investment okay king so yung unang una investment kay king company or king corporation number of shares is 10,000 total cost is 700,000 pesos okay sunod kay plastic plastic. So, may mga movement na kay plastic. Una, meron siyang yung shares niya ay 10,000 plus meron siyang stock dividend na 2,000 and meron pa siyang share split na nangyari which is 541. So, ta times pa natin ito ng 5 12,000 times 5. So, so far, sa so October 1, meron na tayong 60,000 shares of plastic company. And ang total cost is 660,000 pesos. Hindi, walang epekto dun sa cost ng shares or sa cost or sa total cost ng investment. Next, October 1 receive a cash dividend of 5 pesos per share from King Corporation. So, the journal entry would be on October 1, where the cash dividend would be debit cash, uh, 5 pesos per share, times the number of shares is King. Meron tayong 10,000 shares sa kanya, 50,000 credit dividend income 50,000 next October 31 plastic company offered shareholders rights to subscribe to one new share for every 10 rights standard at 20 at the time of issuance the market value of stock right is 3 pesos. Stock rights are not accounted for separately. 